Mobile County workers are busy getting ready for the election. Today, gathering in a warehouse in West Mobile to test out almost 200 voting machines. News 5's Bill Riles has more. 187 voting machines will be deployed for next week's election between Roy Moore and Doug Jones. And right now, workers here for Mobile County are making sure that all of these machines operate properly. It's unusual to have a December election day, but uh, we're going to have one next Tuesday. And that means for the third time since August, these machines get a thorough check. We put the ballots through any... any um, type of scenario that ballot may have on it on election day to make sure it's reading correctly and when we are satisfied we button the machines up zero the totals and make sure they're ready for delivery to the precinct another factor for a special election like this one for a u.s senate seat it'll be costly while it's not yet known how much this election will cost mobile county probate court judge don davis says the primary runoff and general election in 2016 cost nine hundred eighty nine thousand dollars each of these election days in 2017 comes comes with its own cost for materials, for uh, programming of the machines, for the payment to the workers that work on election days. From the Mobile County Voting Machine Warehouse, Bill Riles, News 5.